Stars who left us on January 19, 2024. We take a moment to commemorate some big stars who unfortunately have left us. Let's look back together at their contributions and the lasting impression they have made. The news of the passing of John Juan Mendez, renowned as Silent Servant, the DJ and producer based in Los Angeles, has left a void in the music community. Confirmation of Mendez's departure came through an email from his management, Triangle Agency, addressed to resident advisor earlier today, January 19th. The cause of his death remains undisclosed. A luminary in the realm of electronic music for more than three decades, Mendez, rooted in Los Angeles, gained prominence as a pivotal member of the era-defining techno collective, Sandwell District, alongside Regis, female and function. Following the disbandment of Sandwell District in 2011, Mendez, in collaboration with Regis and James Ruskin, launched the Jealous God label. The label became a platform for releasing works from artists like Varg, Faze Fatale, and Black Merlin. John Juan Mendez, with his multifaceted contributions, has left an indelible mark on the world of music, and he will be remembered not only for his groundbreaking sonic creations, but also for his diverse artistic pursuits. Renowned singer and musician Yogesh Vedya, aged 77, has bid farewell. His melodic voice graced numerous beloved Nepali and Nepal Pasa songs, leaving an enduring legacy. Vadya breathed his last on Thursday, leaving behind a void in the music world. As reported by the family, Vadya passed away at 12.30 a.m. on January 19, while en route to the Sundhara-based Kathmandu Valley Hospital. The singer, grappling with diabetes for an extended period, encountered health complications in the afternoon. His condition worsened at night, prompting his swift hospitalization. Recently, Vedya underwent a kidney transplant and was also dealing with issues of paralysis. His family shared that the singer faced health challenges after some complications arose. Among his noteworthy works are songs like Sepana Bule Sawara, Mero Ayan Shumaya, Nahanse, and Nepal Mero Timale Upahar Bayo. These compositions stand as testaments to Vedya's musical prowess, resonating with audiences and etching his name in the annals of Nepali music history. The passing of Yogesh Vedya marks the end of an era, leaving behind a cherished musical legacy that will continue to captivate hearts. Li Duyong, born on December 24, 1924, was a South Korean film director. After his debut in 1969 with the film The Lost Wedding Veil, 1970, Lee made more than 60 amazing films in a wide array of genres. In the 1970s, he introduced Korean-style action films, including The Korean Connection, 1974, and Left Foot of Wrath, 1974. His film Malaya Malaya, 1984, created great controversy in the Korean media, as well as in the West, due to the graphic portrayal of a woman's subjugated life during the Yi Dynasty. Lee Du Yong died in Seoul from terrible lung cancer on January 19, 2024, at the age of 81. He will never be forgotten. Who will always remain in our thoughts is Giuseppe Ticli. He was a great Italian footballer known for his role as a midfielder. Throughout his entire professional career, he dedicated himself to the lower divisions, notably in Series C1 and Series C2. Tykley, a former midfielder with experience in Serie B, spent his entire professional journey in these divisions. Born April 5 in 1979, he was married and a father of two. Unfortunately, on the morning of Thursday, January 18, 2024, at the age of 44, Giuseppe Tikli passed away. The cause of his death remains unknown. Our thoughts are with his family. Shaughnessy Campbell Barber, born on 27 May 1994, died on 17 January 2024. He died at age 29 from medical complications following a period of ill health. He was not just a Canadian track and field athlete, he was a soaring spirit in the world of pole vaulting. Barber soared to great heights, not only clinching the title of a world champion with a breathtaking height of 5.90m, 
at the 2015 World Championships in Athletics in Beijing, but also conquering the Pan American Games in 2015, leaving a legacy with a remarkable height of 5.80 meter. His accomplishments extended to winning a bronze medal at the 2014 Commonwealth Games in Glasgow, marking a milestone in his illustrious career. On the 25th of July, 2015, Barber achieved his outdoor personal best, a phenomenal jump of 5.93 meters, a feat that still stands as the current national record, resonating with the echoes of his extraordinary talent. His indoor personal best of 6 meters from 2016, a Canadian indoor record, further emphasized his unparalleled skill. Barber's name is etched in history, tied for the Pan Am record alongside El Zaro Borges, and he holds the NCAA collegiate indoor record at an astounding 5.91 M. The world of athletics lost not just a record breaker, but a passionate soul who defied gravity with every leap, leaving an indelible mark on the hearts. As we conclude this journey through the lives of remarkable individuals, let us carry forward the lessons learned from their achievements, challenges, and legacies. The stories of these beautiful people remind us that each individual has the power to shape the world in unique ways. As we navigate our own paths, may their experiences inspire us to pursue our passions, overcome obstacles, and leave a positive impact on the world.